Now do it again, but harder, and flipped. Yes. Wait, we're starting at the end here, aren't we? This is the end of the stage. Maybe that's what they mean by flip. I will say, after playing through the entire game, these stages at the start don't seem so bad anymore. <laughs> it got pretty bad at one point there. But that bit there is a bit tricky. You need to like land it. The exact perfect spot so you can jump on top and then jump to this one, land on top, jump to this one, land on top. Oh baby, I got it! <laughs> okay. Very close. Like I say, very tough jumps. Bam. Hickory dickory backwards. This one's just falling, isn't it? Basically just falling. It's like swap to the right color, I guess. I was lucky with the grandfather clock coming in there at the right time. Because that thing will come in, it will mess you up. There you go, got it. I'm kind of skipping over a lot of the bobbles here. But... The chimney. It is getting darker the higher I'm going. Bam. A lot of these aren't super long. I actually got all the small bubbles as well. Fine rack. Ah! Oh wait, that was my bad. You can just land down here, that's nice. Oh, no, we want to wait for the dark one. There we go. I got all the small ones. The big one was just up in the top thing. Okay, sliders. Pretty low here. There's a bathroom behind me. I'll just stick to one side, I think. Here. Sliders, if you don't say. Bang! Perfect score, flawless. Our dance floor is flipped. Oh. That was not prepared. <laughs> Hear the beat. <laughs> I can. I cannot. The other one was a little bit easier to pick up.
Don't we keep changing it. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh, I got a little cone hat. Furnace flipped. <laughs> That's hilarious. You just spawn out, and if you're not doing anything, you're dead. I guess if you don't want all the things, you can just like start going, working your way backwards. I don't think this one should be too bad backwards. Say that, and then I die. Over and over again. <laughs> Sneak past here when. Oh, you want to sneak past when this one's white, I think there's nothing that can kill us at the end. <laughs> yeah. Okay, workshop. My old nemesis. Backwards. <laughs> Which means I don't have to do the wall, so it might be better, actually. I think I can just, like, kind of pass by the wall. I just have to fall down the wall. I don't actually have to climb the wall. Which was the problem. <laughs> need to make sure that I land not on a saw down here or on the wrong color. It's a 50-50 chance. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I had the right color. Honestly, so much easier backwards. I just want to make sure I get this jump right here. Slide down. I'm not too fussed about the the beads, to be honest. Well, probably a bit harder if you were going for beads, but... Yeah, no, the workshop was so much better backwards. So much easier. <laughs> Let's go to floor nine. I don't have enough for that. It doesn't say how much you... Hmm, maybe you need to perfect score everything to get these. I'd say we basically completed the game. We finished the story, which is nice. The cat did end up turning back into a normal cat again. So that's good, we saved the cat. So yeah, I got this game from the developers. Please do check out the game on Steam. It's called Catbox Paradox. Uh, it was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed it. Very good if you like platforming games. Thank you everyone for tuning in today and uh, raining and lightning out.